Ladies, what's going on? Take two. I don't know what's going on. Hi, guys. Hey. <laughs> Look at our holiday I love set. it. I love it. I love our special visitor that we have over here. <laughs> do you love our special guest? He's, like, very dear to my heart. He is. We'll have to do some elf shirts later yes. this month. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Please. Give yeah. me all the elf shirts. I know. I love them I wish them all. TikTok and Instagram could see our whole setup. Uh, can I you know, pan, pan it? Pan, pan, pan it for them. Quick, pan so it so they can see. see. Ah, look how cute. We got elf. Elves are. We got oh, elf. He's, he's our adorable. Christmas mascot. Yes, uh, our pretty garland. I could. Sh I can't show you all the different. Everything yeah. is gorgeous. Look at so our setup, Insta. We got Elf over there. <laughs> like and the we got. Cute. <laughs> so cute. And, and oh, you'll see the whole setup. Thanks, <laughs> Here and they're like, our arms are so tired. Yeah, from putting the vinyl on this. Yes, we're very fatigued. Yes. So, anyway. um, but anyways, it was so worth it. The outcome is gorgeous, it and is. we're really happy to have a new set. Black Friday has left the building, and now we are gearing up for Christmas. <laughs> Your name's Buddy. I just forgot. Buddy the Elf. Yeah. He's Buddy. He's Buddy the Elf. Buddy the Elf. In his yellow tights, my favorite color. I know. There's a lot of reasons why I love Buddy the Elf so much. That's just one of them. Yeah, so. he's hilarious. I know, he's pretty great. He's so fun. So, guys, we have so many awesome things in overstock, right? I, are these in overstock? We were supposed to put them in there. Okay, you didn't tell me that. Okay, sorry. <laughs> so, we are going to be adding this stuff to overstock today. Strip flock. Yes, stuff is strip flock. <laughs> and we're so excited because this is going to give you all the warm and fuzzy feelings. Yes. I have strip block on my shirt today, and it's like the coolest textured soft it fuzziness. It feels so I don't have it on mine, but I'm just touching it. It feels so cool on shirts. It's really great for kids or babies like because yeah. it's just so soft and cozy. Yes, I love strip block. I use it all the time at home. And so I'm really excited to show you guys what it can do today. We're gonna yeah. be doing a cute snowman. Is it on the S? Is it on? I have not. No, no I we have had to tweak it some. Yeah. So. Uh, hopefully we can upload it. It's just a basic snowman. Though. Yeah. So he is pretty basic. Anyway, I don't know. If we'll, I don't know if he'll upload correctly. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> um, but you guys, if y'all did try. not hear, if y'all had not heard, we extended our free shipping over thirty-five dollar yes. orders. So you guys need to be sure and take advantage of that. Is there still Marty and Shala mystery boxes? I stuff? think so. I've noticed them picking them a lot upstairs. When I go upstairs, Good. the pickers will be like, "Wait, what's this?" And da da da. We gotta fix a couple things on our. Yeah, table. our sheet is not super explanatory. This Expla time. Yes, they were a little confused, so but it is jam packed full of amazing stuff. Um, we won't tell you what's in it, but if you want to see a preview of what's in, of what past boxes have had, you can go to our Facebook group True. and you can search Margie and Shiloh Mystery Box and different customers have uploaded their mystery box when they've gotten them. That they have. And if you want a behind the scenes of us building the mystery box, yeah. there is a TikTok in black and white, of course, because you don't need to see what we choose. Um, but there's a TikTok of us building it and we always have a lot of fun going through it's the so store fun. and just picking out stuff. And I think you're going to love this. This box. I think so too. I think it's pretty epic. It so is great. Each time we think, how are we going to top it? And then we do. Yes. It's <laughs> so fun. We love it. When I think like, and we try to theme them. And so like when different months come around, it's mm -hmm. like more exciting because depending on what's going on in that month, we yeah, can get inspired. We so. can. And we had some fun inspiration yes. for this one. So you guys, this is the last Margie and Shiloh mystery box of the year. 2020. Oh 2021 gosh. will be the next time we build That's a Margie and Shiloh crazy. mystery box. Hallelujah for crazy? 2020 being <laughs> over. <laughs> it's been the longest um, year Yeah, ever. like I'm just going to say like, my whole personal life changed yesterday in a massive way, so I'm yes. so ready to like just move past and forward and like, yeah, so awesome. Yeah. So we have a really quick question. Let's hear it. How much is the mystery box? It is $80. $80, and guys, it is well worth over $100 in value. Oh, so yeah. 
I mean, yeah, every single time we give you all guys a lot of bang for your buck, you're getting more products than what you're spending. So that's a really fun way to just get more than what you're paying for and then be excited in a mystery yeah. all in the same If way. you were to go to put it all in your cart on your own, when mm. you get it, it would be over $100 Absolutely. worth of products. Karen asked, are you going to upload the shirt SVG you had on yesterday? They can't find it. Oh, yes. I need a reminder. Which one? That one that I wore yesterday with the, uh, the, oh, the that Christmas you made at tree, home. the oh, Christmas yeah. tree that was full of words. Yes. Yes. I need to upload That's right. that. Yes. She made that at home, so she I didn't did. have it on the computer here. It's so. not here, y'all. I'll, <laughs> I'll have to email it to myself and get it on for you guys. Yes. But I will do that. Emery's writing me a note right now. Um, sorry, there's a lot going on for December, there as you is. guys can imagine. We have some fun things planned for Yay! December. I'm so excited. Is it Friday that we're going to announce our special yes. December? We have a new product that we're going to be offering and? for December only, and we're going to announce it Friday. We think y'all are going to love it. We're super excited about it. Y'all um, are definitely going to love it. It's something that we've never done before. Never. So, hopefully, y'all will be as excited about it as we are. Yes, we are <laughs> thrilled, and we cannot wait. So, um, I think that's kind of it. I think we should yeah, get started. Let's so, get started. today, we're going to be using our Bella Canvas Navy. Oh, I got Gildan. Oh, Gildan, sorry. I got Gildan. a Gildan. I got a Gildan Navy. The great part about Gildans is, is that, like, they hold up really well. They're very durable, mm -hmm. and they're only, like, 425, They're right? 425. So, we Super have... Super good. Yeah, we have them in small to extra large. Yes. In the Gildan. I have a question. Sorry, I was trying to figure out how to pronounce it. Okay. Aura's Tumblr's ass, is the one you're wearing today available as an SVG? I'm assuming either of y'all or both of y'all. Um, no. And, and yes. Is this one on there? Yeah, that one is mm -hmm. on there. Corbin made this last year. She had a really cool weeding video where they did a time lapse where she weeded it. Y'all know I would never weed a shirt like this. But this is in soft flex gold. I love it. It's so pretty. I love how... We were supposed to use Sarge box, and there was no Fireball. Okay, so anyway. Sarge's Bright Ideas asked, do you have the Santa sacks in stock? Yes! There are some Santa sacks in stock. We have blank ones, and we have a few of our ones that come pre-printed still in stock. You'll just want to go to blanks and bundles, Santa sacks. Okay, this one is available. The Christmas truck, it's $1.50 on the website. If you want to buy it in the SVG spot, you can sort by Christmas. Yes, and I will upload this one as well for free. I made this one at home, too. You so. did. Yes. <laughs> so I will definitely get two SVGs from home brought over to work. You. Can you show your shirt a little bit better, Margie? They're wanting to see what it looks like. It's so yes, cute. it is a truck. It's a truck. It's like a mandala truck. It's a, am I standing up too high? No, you're good. <laughs> I'm like, where am I? <laughs> anyway, so it's a mandala truck. It's the soft flex. It's a lot of weeding. I don't know. I don't remember how long it took Corbin to weed it, but they had a time lapse. And yep. did we have it as an ad for we, a little I while? I think we did. It, it might was have been our cover a, photo. It was our cover photo on our Facebook group. So, yeah. Anyway. Um, yes, yeah, so those are really fun to weed if you have good patience. If and you have a pin pin. And if you have a pin pin. Get you a pin pin. Yeah. Um, so, you guys, if y'all are not familiar with our SVG spot, since there's so many questions coming in about SVGs, we have a ton of SVGs for free, and then a few of them do cost, um, but you go to tools and then SVG spot, and you guys can just search through pages and pages of those. Yes. So, we have a couple of comments asking, can y'all introduce yourselves? Oh. Did we forget to say who we are? Yes. I'm Margie. And I'm Shyla. <laughs> and we are the craziness. Of my customers. Of my customers. <laughs> we bring you tutorials and how to's and yes. sales, and then we get to do the Margie Shiloh mystery box. We actually pick all the mystery boxes. We do. Fun fact. Fun fact. <laughs> Fun fact. I feel like we need that, like, in words above us when Shiloh says it. If we could add that somehow, uh, you, you work on a that. A that would be really cute. Fun fact. Yeah. So anyway, fun I'm, fact. I say fun fact a lot, and it annoys people. So. So. Shyla is over marketing and I'm over customer service, but yes. then I also do this part too, so yes. it's fun. Margie so. is a marketing assistant. Yes. Karen said you should change your nutritional facts on your shirt to fun facts. Okay. Fun, fun facts. facts. Fun <laughs> facts of Shyla, and then just go down. That'd be really cute. You should have put that on your favorite things bag yesterday. Oh, fun facts. I should have. You didn't that. introduce your assistant. People so, are wondering. Okay. So, Buddy the Elf. I'm going to bring him over. Yes, just go ahead. Fall? He has a thing taped to his back. <laughs> this is 
buddy, you guys. Meet buddy. He he's he's like super festive. So, and Christmas is his favorite. Yes. And ginormous toilets. And yes. so we just, we had to bring on a Christmas buddy. Sammy had this at her house and she <laughs> brought it for us. Our other marketing assistant, Sammy, she had this life-size buddy the elf and we were like, oh my gosh. So anyway, so he's here. We will be doing some buddy-centric um, crafts later. Oh yes. This month. For so, sure. Yeah, for sure. Must do. Another quick question before y'all start. Can y'all, can people use the SVGs for commercial use? So we have a blurb on our website and I'm just going to read it real quick so you guys can know what this all entails. So it says that you need to choose gift certificate at checkout for free downloads. If that's the only thing that you're downloading, please choose gift certificate. The terms of use and the restrictions is that you may not resell, rent, lease, sublicense, or loan the electronically downloaded files. You must not also use or display the images in electronic format, which enables them to be downloaded or shared in any peer-to-peer -peer or similar file sharing arrangement. So that means that you can use them for your own personal commercial use, but you cannot resell them or offer the download link. And guys, that's kind of common sense anyways. Our yeah. download links expire in 72 hours anyways. So that means you'd have to get a new download link every 72 hours and nobody wants to do that. If you no. guys got an SVG for free, share where you got it. And yeah. let other people get it too. Like, I feel like that's just common sense. Yeah, just share where you got it from. So yeah. um, the strip flock, if y'all haven't used it, it is a fuzzy vinyl. Oh my gosh, Emery, bring that up close so they can see they the can texture. They can see it really good on oh, that brown piece. Like felt, yeah. It's kind of like, yeah. It's felt. It's fuzzy. It um just it is looks awesome. Super so this looks like one it's one. really soft. People will do it on baby blankets, like fleece baby blankets, you know, to put the kid's name on it. Um, it's really great for that. Oh no, you will see. Oh, I can scratch it on the. You can scratch microphone. it and hear it. That's funny. I'll wait for this real quick. Okay. So um, you guys, we're using five colors. Yeah. Five colors of strip flock. And we have how many colors total? Uh, I think there's 17. 17. I think there's 17 of them. So, so if you did not hear us. A weeder. Yeah, I will. Um, if you did not hear us in the beginning, we're going to be putting strip lock on overstock. And if you guys do not know what overstock is, everything in overstock is 25% off. Yes. So, so how much would it be is the question we asked. Yeah, so the sheets are 15 by 12 inch. That's the only size that this product comes in. And I believe they're $4.99 a sheet. I think they're $4.99. So 25% yeah. off of $4.99 is um, $50, $50 a dollar uh, so it's like a dollar twenty-five off. They're four twenty-five. Oh, they're four twenty-five. So mm -hmm. then they're like, yeah, about a dollar. No, is that a dollar off? It's yeah, about yeah, a dollar off. off. Yeah. One about of our viewers' off. internet cut out. So what material are you using? We are using strip flock. This is Caesar strip flock. It is a fuzzy vinyl. We're making a cute little snowman shirt, and we'll try to. I'll try to fine tune the SVG and see if I can get it uploaded later today. I had to kind of, it was giving me <laughs> headaches. <laughs> yes. Is that the last thing? Yeah. Nice. So here we cut the white strip flock out for the snowman's body. And of course, an orange carrot nose. Carrot for the nose. Margie's weeding red um, for the scarf. And then we used black for his hat and his button, eyes and mouth, and buttons on his body. Yeah. And then we have his little arms, which are with brown. And then that's it. That's so, it. guys, there's so many colors of strip flock. It's so fun and easy to use. It gives you all the warm and fuzzy feelings. Mm -hmm. I have it on my shirt today, and I just love how cozy it is. It's so cool. And I almost wore this morning, seriously, when I was in my closet, I was looking at this shirt. Because it doesn't surprise me. I know. And I had another shirt that had strip flock that I seriously almost wore. And I was like, mm, I think I'm going to wear It's going to be a little warmer today, so I'm going to wear short <laughs> sleeves. But when Shala showed up in there, I'm like, oh, I should have worn my other one. Yeah, because we always are in sync and we never we, plan it. We are. So, um, okay. So we need to pre-press our shirt. Always pre-press your shirt, guys. It gives the moisture out and any wrinkles that you have in your garment. And you don't have to pre-press it for very long. 
Um, strip block press is at 311, 311. Mm -hmm. so 311 degrees, and then you're going to press it for 15 seconds, right? Yep. I think it's a warm peel, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so warm pe warm peel. You don't have to wait for it to completely cool, but you don't want to peel it while it's completely hot either. So warm peel. And, guys, it's so easy to use. And we're layering this, right? Yes, we're layering. So, so we'll probably do shorter presses. Yeah. I just got to figure out. Oh, he's so cute. Y'all are going to love this. So, um, you can layer strip block. You're just going to want to press it for less time. So the more layers you have, the less time you will want to press for. Use your heat resistant sheet, y'all. Margie, I think you could probably press the scarf with this, with that layer. Well, it's got, it's got the piece in between it. You see? I'll press the scarf with this layer. Oh, okay. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. I'm just going to trim it down. Okay. Please. I'm going to press this for, what do you think, five seconds? Yeah. It's called strip block, Sharon. Um... One of our viewers said, I'm always nervous my designs will be too big. What size designs do you recommend for adult size? That's great. Great, great So question. anywhere from 10 to 12 inches across, um, depending, like this is a more narrow design, so it's about, it's not 10 inches across, but it's about 12 inches um, from top to bottom, if that makes sense. Yes. So you kind of want to take the shirt. You don't want it to go, like, all the way to your armpits, mm -hmm. so... Just depending, I'm letting it cool a little bit. Okay. Karen asks, is the quantity discount available with Strip Flock? It is. Yeah. So the more you buy, the more you save. Um, the savings begin at 15 sheets. And I can just tell you the price break right here. I have it pulled up. So if you purchase 15 to 29 sheets, it's $3.69 a sheet. 30 to 74 is 335 75 to 149 is 312 and then if you buy 150 or more, it's 295 a sheet. Okay, that's awesome. I'm just going to try to get a few more things on here. I don't know if I can do it. And guys, those, um, those price breaks are automatically built into our website. You don't have to have a fancy coupon code. There's nothing that you need to do. You just need to simply add that many to your cart. You guys can mix and match colors on our buy more, save more, but it has to be of the same product and the same size of that product. Yes, that's a good point. And um, the neon strip flop colors. I might have to do this one separate. The neon strip flock colors will glow in a black light. Yes, so we do have some neon options. I think they're fluorescent mm -hmm. um, is the actual term for that. Mm -hmm. Is there any special washing instructions for strip flock? I, I wash this shirt just like I wash all my other clothes, and it's literally tossed in the washing machine. Okay, I'm going to have to do um, the red after because i got to do the okay. brown. Sure. Okay. I'm going to go over there. Um, the, um, I, I would say that, you know, just be careful. Like this was obviously a light color on a dark shirt. And so some of the lint from my black shirt has stuck to the white. Mm -hmm. Um, and we actually did another shirt with, um, Margie was the, the, um, uh, the homeschool mom she never yes. wanted to be, and I was yes. the homeschool mom that I've always wanted to be because I do homeschool. Um, but we made cute little shirts that said mama and then that on the top and the bottom with strip block. And we noticed that a lot of uh, lint was collecting on our white. Um, so yeah. just keep but that in mind. Yeah, it is fuzzy. It, yeah, you want to be careful with what you wash it in. Yeah, so just be careful, I guess. Um, just keep that in mind if you're if you're making these to sell yeah keep that in mind oh he's really cute oh my gosh he's adorbs all right and then we just have the scarf left to do so cute oh my gosh look at him and strip block is pretty sturdy so it's not like yeah it doesn't get as overheated as quickly as easy weed or holographic. Yeah, it's a thicker layering. material. So um, on our so our cut settings, we tested them out what we had on the website, and it was accurate and correct. On a silhouette cameo, we had a blade of four and a force of 13, mm -hmm. 12, 13. Somewhere 12 or 13, yeah. Um, and it cut it perfect, you guys. So that gives you an idea. You do need to up your blade for this material. Oh, yeah.
Thank you for telling me. <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, I love really this. Cute. That scarf's adorable. Well, and the scarf is very jagged. Like when we cut it, Charlotte was like, "Do you know it's cutting all these jagged yeah. edges?" Yeah. Look how cute. I don't know if you can see the texture of it, so it's really fun. And fuzzy. It's fuzzy. Emery, do you want to show it up close to the TikTokers yes. and Instagrammers? Hope y'all can see like the fuzziness. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully so. He is not on the website yet. The SVG is not available, but they're going to fine tune it yes. and put it on the website. Yeah, it we has some snags. <laughs> Sometimes, y'all, it goes really easily when I'm making SVGs, and sometimes it doesn't. I was answering phone calls and emails, so I kept getting distracted. She <laughs> came up, and she's like, are you done yet? I'm like, no, not yet. Not yet. <laughs> so, anyway, it's this? really cute. Guys, this is so cute. And we, if you're not experimenting with the different types of HTVs out there, do it because yeah. it's so easy to use and it looks so stinking cute and it just adds a fun little different kind of dimension. look and dimension to your project so yeah it might help you stand out if you're like if you're struggling in sales or something it might help you stand out a little bit if you offer something new something different that other people don't have what cut settings do you use for that with a cricket so let me see what i have on here for you guys so um i can't was that a facebook question or not no, it was uh, TikTok. TikTok. Okay, so we'll just go ahead and screen share this, though. Um, yeah. So, y'all, on on TikTok, okay. if you are, you don't think we have um, it open, the, okay. the OBS. Yes, when you go to our website, when you go to the individual products, there's a green button on each page. It'll have cut settings and then a how-to video. So the cut settings will open up and it'll tell you the cut settings for two different Cricut machines and the Silhouette machines and then also how to heat press it. So you're going to want to cut on a Cricut Explorer if you're on an Explore Air. You're going to cut Strip Block Pro on Iron On Plus and use your, uh, leave your pressure set to default. If you're on a Cricut Maker, you're going to choose the Flocked Iron On and you're just going to use the default option. So. So, but we always recommend doing a test cut first, especially if you're getting a new product from us that you haven't cut before. Sometimes your machine is different than ours, test and cut some blades are older than others, so they don't always cut right. Yes. Donna asks, when she uses strip flock, it seems to rip when they're weeding. Does that mean that they're cutting too deep? Or it really does. It has a tendency to tear when you're weeding it. Um, the, the red, I noticed it when I was doing the red yeah. scarf, and what I did is I would start on this inside and weed out. So if you start and go out, it tends to tear less than if you start, if you pull like that. I don't know if that makes sense. Like, start it from does. where you cut and go Any up. Any type of V's in your design, you're going to want to pull out first. Yeah, yeah. so you want to go that way and that way. So it's, it tends to help not, not have as many tears. Danielle asks, do you have to mirror the image? Yes. 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 All of our HTVs, you mirror the image with the exception of our printed pattern HTV. If you'll go overhead, Emery, we'll talk about the side that you cut on also. So you guys can see how this is super glossy and this is dull. So you're going to cut on the dull side. So that means that the glossy side goes down on your mat. And even though we just restuck our mat, we had to tape it. The strip block it does is not so stick to thick, your mat well. it doesn't want to stick to your mat. So use some masking tape or washi tape to hold it in place. Because otherwise, you'll be screwed. Yep, it'll just be moving it'll all around. <laughs> and mess up. We yes. don't want you to waste product. Not at all. Is that everything? That's everything. Let Good. me double check. All right. And it looks to be about all the questions. Well, thanks so much for being on with us. We hope you enjoyed our little snowman. We will work on getting him up on yes. the website. Um, and I clearly have some SVGs to get on the website, too. <laughs> um, so we will do that for you guys to the best that we can. Yeah. And just be sure to take advantage of free shipping over $35, you guys. I was told by Big Boss here that we are going to do it blinded until we decide not to anymore. Okay. So there's no, there's no set date on when this ends. So take advantage of it now because it could possibly end tomorrow. We don't know. Give us um, a few minutes, too, to get the strip block added to, to the overstock. I'll yep. work on that when we get out. 
and you guys be sure to grab your Margie and Shallow Mystery Box. It's the last one of the year, so. You don't want to miss that. No. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. Is that it? You got another Yes, one? we have a couple more questions okay, now. Lauren asks, is there a video on how to retack your mat online? So we do, we upload all of our videos onto uh -huh. our YouTube channel and our web, website. So you guys can go back and watch our video. We had a video probably, did you say was a month ago? the ornaments when we were making the ornaments yeah, that we was. Oh, that was like a couple days ago. That was last, days. It was like a couple weeks ago. It was a couple so weeks. So if you look for the one where we made the glitter ornaments, um, we retacked the mats we at did. the beginning of that with our tack it. Yes, and you guys, all of our lives stay on Facebook too. You guys can go to our videos on our web on our Facebook page and on Instagram, Instagram. and you guys can rewatch our lives. Yeah. So um, that's there's four different places where you guys can rewatch our videos and get all the insight that you possibly needed for mm -hmm. that craft or that material in particular. Yeah. Hopefully that helped answer your question. All righty. All right, guys, get some strip lock, experiment, expand the possibilities. Expand your horizons. <laughs> there is so many good products, and now this is going to be 25% off here in a little bit, so y'all be sure to grab some of this. Yes. And you're going to get free shipping on orders over 35. Yeah. Stay warm and cozy. Stay warm and cozy. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye. -bye. Bye.